and welcome to the new game show, What Would Lozo Do? I'm your announcer, Mike, and welcome again to What Would Lozo Do? A game show that puts contestants against each other for fabulous prizes. A series of pre-answered questions are given to contestants to see if they could figure out what would blows all do? And now, the host of our show, Blozo! Hello, everybody! How the hell are you? I'm Blozo! How are you, everybody? How are you? Thank you so much, thank you. Mike. I'm fine, Blozo. How are you? Great, great. Great to be here. All right, let's start with the show, shall we? Okay. Now, Mike, who's our guest today on What Would Blozo Do? Well, Blozo, he's known and loved around the world at springtime, putting beautiful Easter eggs for children to find everywhere. He's the one. He's the only. He's the lovable. He makes me sick. Bozo, the Easter Bunny. <laughs> Hello, everybody. How is everyone? Hi, Bozo, you dumbass. <sighs> Never liked him. The next member of our panel, Bozo, is a model, actress, and owner of the Brown Sugar Escort Service on Manhattan's Park Avenue. It's the beautiful, the incomparable, and lovely Sugar. Hey, babies, how y'all doing? Hey, Sugars, thank you, thank you so much. Hello, Blozo. Hey, Sugar, looking good, honey. You're looking good too, honey. Thank you. Hey, Easter Bunny. And last but not least, Blozo. An American hero, an operative in the United States Special Forces, and also sidelines part-time in the adult entertainment industry in the sadomasochistic field, it's Sergeant Brute. Good to be here. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. All right, thanks, ladies and gentlemen. Now let's uh, do our first round. Each question is worth 15 points. I'm performing my act on a circus show, but an obnoxious heckler keeps shouting at me. What would Blozo do? That's right, Blozo. What would Blozo do in that situation? Would Blozo A. Go into the audience and smash a custard pie into the heckler's face? Or did he answer B. Yell at the heckler and tell him that his mother was a hyena and his father was a baboon? Or is it C. Have the bearded lady rape the heckler after the show! Or is it D? None of these! Which one did he answer? Panel? Sugar! Well, Blozo, I think I choose B, Blozo. I'd yell him and belittle him. Make a fool out of him, Blozo. All right, Mike. Is that the correct answer that I gave? Uh, oh, sorry, sugar. That's the incorrect answer. Anyone else? Easter Bunny. Well, Blozo, I picked D because all the other answers are mean and not nice to do. All right, 
Mike. He's a big pathetic rodent, right? Uh. Oh, sorry, Easter Bunny. That's incorrect. Since the Easter Bunny and Sugar got it wrong, 15 points go to Sergeant Brute. Hey, wait a second. That's not fair. Too bad, Bunny. It's my show. And like they say in Russia, Dovsky, Krabsky, comrade. <laughs> okay, everybody. Ready, panel, for the next question? Here we go. I see an old lady crossing the street. She trips and falls at the crosswalk. What would Blozo do? Mike, what are the answers? Okay, Blozo. What would Blozo do and what did he answer to that question? Was it A. Help the old lady up and walk her safely to the sidewalk while opening her purse and stealing her social security check? Oh, Lozo. Or would it be B. See if she needs assistance, help her up, and walk her safely to the sidewalk? Or would it be C. Pretend not to see her trip over the old board, and then take it to court and sue her. Or would it be D, laugh at the old board? All right, panel. Anyone? Easter Bunny. Well, we should all be nice and kind, but I know how sick and evil you are, Blozo, so I think it's D. You would laugh at her, which isn't very nice. Mike, is that the correct answer? Eh. Oh, sorry, Easter Bunny, but thanks for your social commentary, you furball. All right, Mike, what did I answer? Okay, Blozo. Anyone else? No one else rings the buzzers. So, the answer is... Help and assist her! That's right, Blozo. You answered for question two. B. Help and assist the old lady. That's right. But wait a second! That's not like you! Hey, you gotta respect your elders, you furball! I may have biting with a dry satire, but I respect old ladies, you mutant pink putrid creature! Oh, Blozo! And by the way, Mike, what was my answer for question one? You didn't give it to the audience! I'm sorry, Blozo. For question one concerning the heckler, you answered C. You would have the bearded lady rape the heckler after the show. All right, Mike. All right, Mike. So how do we stand now after question two? Well, Blozo, now Sergeant Boot is awarded with 15 points, which makes his score 30. And Sugar makes her score 15. Easter Bunny has zero. Sorry, Easter Bunny. <laughs> okay, let's continue. All right, everybody. Let's continue for question three. I see an old girlfriend. Who broke my heart years ago? She left me for the strong man of the circus. <sighs> she had his child. But I heard she named the child after me. 
Little baby blow shell. Hell, oh, so cute. What would blows all do? Mike? Okay, Blozo. What did Blozo answer for that question posed to him? Would it be A. Walk by her as if she was a stranger, ignoring her and her child as Blozo's heart sank and his heart filled with anger and despair? Or was it B. Forgive and forget, greet her with a smile, but then insult the baby and say how ugly it is. So, oh, oh, would it be C. Give her a smake, fake smile and walk by and while doing so, saying under Blozo's breath what a bitch whore she was for leaving him. Or was it D? Call her a whore slut and grimace under your breath as you walk by. Hey, thanks, Mike. Okay, guys. What did Blozo do? Anyone? Sugar! Well, Blozo, I have to say it's probably B. Forgive and forget, greet her with a smile, but then insult the child. I do that myself. That is a good one. Uh, sugar. Mike. Oh, sorry, sugar. That's incorrect. Anyone else? Easter Bunny. Well, Blozo, I know you have Italian's old timers. And what's that? You won't even remember the grudges. Yeah. <laughs> Sergeant Fruit. Ah, I say take the pain, take the pain. I say you would do A, walk by her as if she was a stranger and ignore her and take the pain in your heart. Okay, Sergeant Brute. Mike, is that a correct answer? Yes, it is. Sergeant Brute is correct. You answered A. Alright, thanks Mike. That means 15 points go to Sergeant Brute. That gives him 45. Yeah! It's all good. And 30 points go to Sugar. Oh, thank you, honey. Thank you so much. And a big Easter egg for the Easter Bunny. folks we'll be back after this commercial for our final round for what would blozo do you're full of crap just like a lot of people in the world that's why I recommend eat bowel movements a more regular would eat laxative. Get rid of some of the crap in your life. New eat. Now in ginger lemon flavor. Yummy. Number one doctor recommended. Lighten up your load. Would eat. I feel five pounds lighter myself. Get eat laxative today. Sold in finer pharmaceuticals. Eat. Alright folks, welcome back. This is our final round with our final question. This question is worth 50 points. Are you ready, panel? <sighs> hey Sugar, I'm always ready. I'm ready, Bozo. Okay. Here's the question. I'm in the lotto pool and all my friends at the circus chip in every week and play lotto. One week I'm off, and all my co-workers hit the pool for a hundred million dollars. 
but I was off that week, and they didn't put in for me, and they didn't share the winnings with me. What would Blozo do? Alright, Blozo. What did Blozo answer? Panel, was it A, let bygones be bygones, forgive them, and wish them all luck as you curse them under your breath, or is it B, get a lawyer and sue their asses and announce it to the media, or is it C, wish them well in their early retirements and then track them down one by one at their exotic vacations and kill them. One by one, systematically. Who is it, D? Write a book about your deal and try to make a fortune out of your misfortune while belittling, belittling all your friends and co workers in the book. Thanks, Mike. Wow, another tough one. All great answers. Panel? Sugar. Hi, Bluzo. I'm gonna say. Mm. B. Get a lawyer and sue their asses and then announce it to the media. And while I'm on the subject, come visit Sugar's Escort Service, Brown Sugar, located on Park Avenue in Manhattan. Alright, Sugar, no free plugs, please. Alright. Is that the correct answer, Mike? Oh, sorry, sugar. That's incorrect. Anyone else? I'd waterboard them, torture, kill them, waterboarding. Take it easy there, Sergeant Boot. Mike. Oh, sorry, Sergeant Brute. You have to answer A, B, C, or D. You didn't do neither. I can't help it. It's my marine training. It's all instinct. Okay. That means that the winner is... The Easter Bunny! Oh my god! With 50 points! I'm so excited! I'm being in my pants! Oh, thank you! Oh my god! Oh! Good things happen to nice people! Thank you so much, everyone! Thank you! Congratulations, Easter Bunny! And you won an all expense trip to hell! Yes, Easter Bunny! You won an all expense 10 day trip to hell! You'll start your trip, yes, on a cruise across a burning lake of sulfur, breathing in that tainted sulfur air. Ah, clears the lungs, doesn't it? From then, you spend a few days in the valley of lost souls, hearing their cries of anguish and grinding of their teeth in torment. Then, yes, finally you meet the big man himself. Yes. Known as the deceiver, the liar, the great imposter. Yes, in all his wicked majesty, you'll have a personal appearance with the devil. Yes, he's the bunny. Just be happy, it's a round trip. And congratulations again, and enjoy your trip to hell.
Good night, Julius. Good night, everybody. Good night, friends, all you dummies. Yeah. Prize vacation provided by Lucifer Tours. Call Lucifer Tours for the hottest vacation spots. Literally. All contestants will receive a one year supply of eat laxative. Get the crap out of your life with eat. What will Portal do is a Trocadero production. Good night, everybody. I'm Mike. And see you next time on What Will Bozo Do?